We realize you have a busy lifestyle. And at the Bank of Jackson, we're here to help you fulfill all of your financial needs, personal and business loans, mortgages, online banking and bill pay, and so much more. Serving the Jackson area for 25 years. The Bank of Jackson, your down-home community bank. You belong here. Member FDIC Equal Housing Lender. Are you looking for a Christian college or starting the college search process? I want to take a second to tell you about my school, Union University in Jackson, Tennessee. Union is a private four-year university known for its rigorous academics, Christ-centered community, and the success of its graduates. My favorite part about Union is the faculty. The professors here are so intentional about helping students grow not only academically, but also spiritually. You should check out Union for yourself. Come for a visit. I know you'll love it. At Union University, you'll be transformed. Championship DNA. That's what you find in Jones Chevrolet at Three Way. A full line of new Chevrolets plus West Tennessee's largest used car inventory. State of the art service work and pre approved auto loans online at JonesChevroletHumboldt.com. Shop with a winner. Jones Chevrolet at Three Way. most important benefit when you buy from Jones Chevrolet at Three Way? Peace of mind. Jones Chevrolet's warranty forever comes with every qualifying new and pre-owned vehicle. Powertrain coverage for as long as you own your vehicle. Find out more at Jones Chevrolet in Three Way. Thank you. 
couldn't figure out if that was Tom Ducks or if that was just a Lucky 
Nicholas Hewerman. Hey, let's try to keep it, boys. You know we can. Yeah, we got the ball. We got to counter him. They don't come back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Back. Yeah. 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 Kenny. 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 Oh, 
Don't want to be on the board. Please, 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 please,
Number 18, Jacob Blue. Again for the minors, number 15, Jacob Bandy, number 21, Connor Hoy, and number 24, Aaron Burrell. Thank you. 
for Union, number two, Billy Grogan. Coming in for the Bulldogs, number 17, Jacob Phelps. Coming in for the Miners, number eight, Shane Karen. Get it! 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 Get it!
Number seven, Austin Bowen. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Paro. Paro. And we make it look so bad, so we've been cranking for a long time. So who's ready to rock and roll? Rock and roll! Rock and roll! Rock and roll! Rock and roll! One minute remaining. The word excellence implies uh, one or more standards of excellence by which to measure. We represent Jesus Christ, and, and there is no greater standard of excellence. Our approach to excellence has been validated, for example, by uh, the careers of one of our graduates, who, while she was a graduate student at Duke, solved a theoretical physics problem that had gone unsolved for 30 years. When I onboard new students, uh, I share a, a story about why I chose Union. I chose Union because excellence matters. And I tell them 
that when you do all things to glorify Christ, excellence is the expectation. The class of 2020 uh, had a 98% pass rate on the NAPLEX, which uh, ranked us number one in the state of Tennessee. Nationally, it gave us a ranking of eight out of 140 some odd colleges of pharmacy across the U.S. The debate team has really helped me in all areas of my life, specifically academically. It's helped me to think critically because I don't get to choose which side of a topic that I get to argue on. And so when I go into my classes, I'm able to look at things from all angles and think critically about it. Being a part of the debate team that did win the national championship was really, really rewarding. Not only did we win the national championship, but we did it for our teammates, we did it for our school, but most importantly, we did it for the glory of God. At Union, we seek to be Christ-centered in all we do. We don't focus on Christ-centeredness just in the chapel. One of the great opportunities I have in serving at Union is meeting students from all over the world. And one specific student that I think of is J.D. Martinez. And since coming here, I've watched him grow in his walk with Christ, connect to a local church, invest in others, share the gospel with others, and be a godly man. He, in many ways, is a great example of a student that we're hoping to invest in. I'm J.D. Martinez. I'm, I'm a senior from Tampa, Florida. I'm um, studying business management. So coming to Union, I had never actually had a Christ-centered life modeled for me. It's the genuine heart of Union, and I think it permeates from every level, from the top all the way to the bottom, including the students. It really changed my life and what it looked like to be a follower of Christ. It's no longer I, it's Christ who lives in me, and like that's not something that just happens at church, but it's something that happens throughout all of my life. And the Office of University Ministries here at Union, we seek to help students take their next step in their walk with Christ. And we do that through chapel, discipleship groups, mission trips that we call go trips, service opportunities. And one of the things we understand is that every student, every faculty member, every staff member has a next step to take in their walk with Christ. And we want to come alongside of students to do that, to help them grow, to help them connect to a local church, to know God's word and to serve and to advance God's kingdom all over the world. This commitment to being people focused exists all through the university and serving as faculty in residence has given me the opportunity to see that. Union is very intentional, not just for academics, but also in establishing those meaningful relationships. When Union created the faculty and residents position, one of the things that was emphasized was to create more of a living and learning environment. Wonderful discussions of an academic nature over wonderful food and a more relaxed environment, but they also get a chance to see to what degree do faculty members walk uh, our talk. I had a student that's a member um, of the Common Table group and she just came by to visit with me one day. The students have just been great in terms of the way in which they have chosen to love us. As faculty and staff, uh, we understand what we need to do to make the community uh, a distinctive Christian university community. But it's heartwarming to see students who not only appreciate that, but uh, contribute to it being just that. We are very excited about the donation that the McAfee family has made for a new building on the Great Lawn. One of the benefits that I see from the new building is that we will be able to recruit at a higher level. This new building is going to be state-of-the-art. It's going to house engineering and computer science as well as the McAfee School of Business where there will be great synergy amongst all of our majors. Interacting with other disciplines, the business world, uh, computer science, sciences in general, um, is essential for the development of new uh, leading edge technologies. In engineering, we use and develop technology in order to improve the world around us. We want to help the people around us through the technology and the projects that we develop. And it's exciting to watch our students do so successfully. We can't wait to embrace all that the Lord has for us in the future. Each of these core values, excellence driven, Christ-centered, people-focused, and future-directed, indeed are part of Union's DNA. They're who we are. And the reality is that all the core values in the world, you could print them on everything and put them on every building, but if we don't live them out, 
they don't amount to anything. And so at Union, we want these core values to be how we're fulfilling our mission to the glory of God and for the good of all people.
Ohio Lutus and number 18, Jacob.
Coming in for the Miners, number five, Joe Muller, and number 20, Robert Sullentrop. number two, Quincy Cummings, and number nine, Grant Pullman.
Number 19, Sam Brissett, and number 22, Louise Burns. Coming in for the Bulldogs, number 17, Jacob Phelps.
Number nine.
Number six, Santiago Cervantes, and number 14, Jason Jorgensen. Coming in for the Bulldogs, number seven, Austin Bowen. Let's go. 
Again for the minors, number 10, Sigurd Simlich, and number 28, Emery Gunvenili. Coming in for the Bulldogs, number 26, Chris Grill.
Number three, Zach Pendleton. Number 27, Nathan Wayrout. And number 29, Jacob Lee. Miners, number 28, Emery Guvenil.
Yeah. 